The Hot Ones, season 13, premieres tomorrow, Thursday, October the 1st at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And guess who's holding down the number four spot? Angry Goat Pepper Company's Goat Rider Hot Sauce. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Okay, I'm excited about this one because this is the brand new sauce from the Angry Goat Pepper Company called Goat Rider. And this is going to be featured on Season 13 of The Hot Ones, which premieres tomorrow, October the 1st. Now check this out. That is one gorgeous looking label on there. Before I forget, I want to mention that that is uh, the artwork. Artwork on that one was done by Amber Boyce of Amber Destiny Tattoos. Just a beautiful looking label on this one. Check that out. Angry Goat Pepper Company's Goat Rider Hot Sauce. Now, I'm a big fan of Jason and Roberta Parker and their Angry Goat Pepper Company. Their hot sauces are outstanding. I've reviewed uh, many of them on my channel throughout the past few years. So make sure you check that out. But let's go ahead and get into this one, guys. Once again, this is uh, going to hold down the number four spot on season 13 of The Hot Ones. I think the first one that Angry Goat was able to get on the show, I forgot what season, but that was their Hippy Dippy green uh, sauce made with avocados. So that was really good. Okay, let me go ahead and read what it says about this one, guys. It says, created especially for the open road. Horsepower thumping, rebellious types. This sauce has a flavor first approach with a slow burn second. We combine balsamic vinegar with Vermont maple syrup, and uh, Angry Goat does that so well. Garlic and cayenne peppers to create a unique, savory, slightly sweet sauce. We also add a touch of ghost peppers just to fire it, just to fire it up some extra horsepower. Try this sauce on wings, pizza, eggs, fried rice, steak tips, or as a salad dressing. Yeah, I bet that would be good on a salad salad dressing. Now, they do have this one rated uh, medium heat level, uh, 5 out of 10. Uh, the sodium is listed at only uh, 30, 34 milligrams, so it's not bad. But here are the ingredients on this one, guys. Balsamic vinegar. And we have cayenne pepper mash. Vermont maple syrup, roasted red peppers, which are roasted uh, bell, red bell peppers, uh, molasses, garlic powder, apple cider vinegar, ghost pepper mash, smoked paprika, and they got to add, add some more ghost pepper powder. So all, all natural ingredients on this one, guys. Doesn't that sound good? No xanthan gum, no preservatives. Uh, yeah, this is going to be good. Check that out. Look at that dark rich color on this one now this reminds me both in the look and the flavor of angry goats a super super delicious chocolate habanero balsamic and black garlic hot sauce so i'll just go ahead and say it if you're a fan of that that hot sauce i think you're really really going to dig this one goat rider all right let's check out the aroma and what I get from this one is I get some really nice savory notes. I would get that uh, kind of that tang. I love that flavor combination, what he does with the balsamic vinegar and the, uh, the uh, Vermont maple syrup. I smell the roasted peppers, very, very savory roasted bell peppers in here along with the garlic. Super, super savory. Um, it's got a, it's got a, a kind of a, almost, uh, it doesn't have chocolate in it, but it, it just kind of smells like a, a dark chocolate vibe. And that's coming from the, those, uh, the um, roasted red peppers, the cayenne peppers, the roasted red peppers, and the maple syrup is what I'm trying to say. But this one smells so, so good, guys. Really, really good. That, that balsamic vinegar and that maple syrup. And then the molasses. Ooh, this smells good. All right, let's go ahead and check it out on a spoon. Do a spoonful of Goat Rider. Okay, nice consistency, not too thick, not too thin. All right, here we go. Mm. Woo! <coughs> this one kind of took me by surprise. 
it's a little bit spicy it really gets you it's definitely in a medium i'm i'm gonna go ahead and say it now this is definitely for me a five out of ten um, it's right there in the middle but wow delicious flavor combination smoky sweet you get the maple you get the roasted red peppers um, you get the cayenne peppers that balsamic vinegar just I think just really showcases everything I think the balsamic vinegar really brings out the flavors of everything else that's in this sauce the same way it did it uh, in um, angry goats uh, chocolate uh, habanero balsamic and uh, black garlic hot sauce uh, that was fantastic there's just something about uh, the way that the balsamic vinegar just brings out the flavors in here it's super super delicious i think jason knows exactly why what he's doing when he uses that balsamic vinegar with these other ingredients super super delicious uh, once again sweet smoky savory slightly tangy uh, it's just a wonderful hot sauce super super delicious i think the the uh the stars and the um people on the uh, season three Season 13 is what I'm trying to say on the hot ones. They're really going to enjoy this one. This is super delicious. And let me show you what I did with this one, guys. I think this would be good on steak, pizza, burgers, uh, tacos, eggs, wings, just like it says on the website, uh, fried rice, even as a super, super delicious spicy salad dressing. I think that would be good. But I put it, I created some, uh, here's what I call my spicy um, balsamic maple smoked pulled pork biscuit sliders and <laughs> that was fantastic this is super super delicious on pulled pork so i highly recommend it uh heat kind of goes away a little bit it kind of those ghost peppers really kind of hit you in this particular hot sauce you know right away and then you know that ghost pepper powder really kicks it up as well but super super delicious flavor still going with a solid five out of ten on heat for this one uh super super Good job on this one, Jason and Roberta, and congratulations on making it back on the Hot Ones Season 13. Guys, check it out. Please check out Angry Goat Pepper Co.'s uh, website, angrygoatpepperco.com. That link will be down in the description for all of their other fantastic hot sauces. They have other um, hot sauce companies that they, uh, that they have that they can ship to you as well, so make sure you check that out. And you can get this one at theheatness.com. That link will be in the description as well, and you can get this, I believe, uh, now through uh, January the 1st, 2021. All right, so check it out. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, Jason and Roberta, thank you so much for letting me review this one. I greatly appreciate it. Guys, stay tuned for a whole lot more, and until the next time, make sure you enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.